Let's face it, Americans love pickup trucks. Five of the 10 best-selling vehicles in the US in 2022 were pickups, and those sales show no signs of slowing. But what are the definitive best trucks you can buy? We've broken down our list of the best trucks of 2023 and 2024 by category, starting with the smallest of the group and working our way up to performance pickups and EVs. All of our rankings are based on driving impressions that editors have collected behind the wheel, taking into account things like power, towing, comfort, and price. Now, let's get into it. Compact trucks have carved out a nice little niche with midsizers getting bigger and bigger each year. But this is still a burgeoning class, so there are only two to choose from. The Ford Maverick and the Hyundai Santa Cruz. Tiny truck lovers should get ready though. We may see more options from brands like Ram and Toyota in the near future. The Santa Cruz beats the Maverick in towing with a 5,000 pound capacity, but the Hyundai falls short elsewhere. The Santa Cruz is more expensive and less efficient than the Ford, and it doesn't offer an off-road trim. It's still a good small truck, but in a class of two, the Santa Cruz is a solid second place. The Maverick ticks all the right boxes for small truck buyers. It's affordable, adorable, and for such a small vehicle, pretty capable too. It can tow up to 4,000 pounds and haul up to 1,500 pounds of payload with the 2.0-liter EcoBoost engine, while the 2.5-liter hybrid setup gives it 37 miles per gallon combined. Who says trucks can't be affordable and efficient? The mid-size truck segment has been heating up for the past few years. The revival of the Ford Ranger and the Chevrolet Colorado brought the American brands back into the fray, followed by the then-new Jeep Gladiator. Now even more mid-sizers are getting revamped. The Jeep Gladiator has one really big upside. It's easily the best off-roader of the bunch. And now that the Chevy Colorado and GMC Canyon are gas only, it's the only mid-sizer you can still get with a diesel engine. But beyond excellent off-roading, the Gladiator is below average in on-road composure, and it's the priciest of the group, with a starting MSRP of $40,885. Getting into the more rugged Rubicon will run you at least $50,000. The Honda Ridgeline doesn't have hardcore off-roading or towing chops due mostly to its unibody construction. Its 3.5 liter V6 is also outdated, underpowered, and inefficient compared to some of the other trucks in the class. This truck costs north of $40,000 to start as well. The Ridgeline is a tough sell, but it does still have the best on-road manners of the group, and the 2024 model adds a more rugged trail sport trim as well as wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Finally, with the 2024 Ranger on the way and most importantly, a Raptor model finally coming to the US, it's worth waiting for the new one. The outgoing 2023 Ranger falls toward the back of the pack due to its outdated and cramped interior, firm ride, and middling powertrain. The Ranger's turbocharged four-cylinder is now less powerful than some of the other trucks in the class, but at least it's still a decent tower. The Nissan Frontier received much-needed updates for the 2022 model year after languishing on the market for a decade and a half. The truck's 3.8-liter V6 pumps out a healthy 310 horsepower, which is enough muscle to put it toward the top of the class in power. The ability to tow 6,640 pounds is also competitive against the Challengers, although it does come up short on the Ranger, Colorado, and Canyon. For nostalgic buyers, Nissan recently revived the hardbody name for a retro-tinged appearance package. The 2024 Toyota Tacoma is a brand new pickup with upgraded options and fresh underpinnings. Buyers can choose power plants producing between 228 and 326 horsepower, and unlike some competitors, the truck is available with a 6-speed manual gearbox in addition to an 8-speed automatic. Folks looking for something more rugged have multiple options, like the TRD Off-Road, TRD Pro, and Trail Hunter trim levels. Check out our review of the new Tacoma here. The GMC Canyon brings luxury to the mid-size pickup segment, but it does have prices to match those premium features. While the truck starts at $38,890, the range-topping AT4X is at least $56,995 before options, which is pretty pricey for the segment. The model is also a capable hauler because the 7,700 pound tow rating is among the best in the category. The Chevy Colorado shares underpinnings with the GMC Canyon, but it offers trim levels that don't have some of those premium features for folks who just want a less expensive truck. Buyers can also get a less powerful version of the turbocharged 2.7 liter four cylinder making 237 horsepower instead of 310. This gives customers a wide range of configurations to pick from, ranging from the basic WT to the off-road oriented ZR2 Bison. One of the most hotly contested categories in America is the full-size pickup segment, and for good reason. Brands like Chevrolet, Ford, and Ram have basically perfected the art of the pickup truck with a variety of trim options, varying powertrains, and loads of luxurious amenities. The Nissan Titan is dead after the 2024 model year, with production ending in the summer. The current truck dates back to a 2016 debut, 
making this quite an old model, especially in the competitive full-size pickup segment. Its specs aren't too bad compared to the rivals, but the model just doesn't have the same level of technology as some of the other offerings in this class. The latest generation of the Toyota Tundra is still fairly new after arriving for the 2022 model year. Buyers can get a hybrid-assisted twin-turbo 3.5-liter V6, making a potent 437 horsepower and 583 pound-feet. The brand offers the truck with an infotainment screen as large as 14 inches, and its standard safety suite includes features like adaptive cruise control, lane centering, and automatic emergency braking. Off-roading aficionados can get the TRD Pro with 2.5-inch internal bypass Fox shocks and a 1.1-inch suspension lift. The 2024 Ram 1500 is the final model before a significantly updated pickup arrives for 2025. This also means that this is the end of the line for the venerable 5.7 liter V8, so if you prefer 8 cylinders of naturally aspirated power, then pick up one of these trucks soon. While down on power and torque in comparison to some of the trucks lower on this list, it can still tow more than them. Although mechanically related to the Chevrolet Silverado 1500, the GMC Sierra 1500 has a few unique touches all its own. Prices start at a modest $38,995, which actually undercuts other full-size trucks on this list. However, the range-topping Denali Ultimate Grade has a starting price of $84,440, and options can take that figure even higher. The available 6.2-liter V8 offers an impressive 420 horsepower, and the optional Duramax Turbo Diesel 3-liter inline-6 allows for towing as much as 13,200 pounds. The Chevy Silverado 1500 offers the same engines and underpinnings as the GMC Sierra, but the biggest differentiators are the styling and available amenities. Upgrades for the 2024 model year include making the 3.0-liter turbo diesel inline-6 available on the ZR2 grade in addition to the carryover 6.2-liter V8. The base WT trim now gets standard wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The Ford F-Series has been the best-selling pickup in the United States for the last 46 years, and there's no sign of that changing anytime soon. The current F-150 model gives buyers a wide variety of powertrain choices, including a turbocharged 2.7-liter V6, a naturally aspirated 5-liter V8, a twin-turbo 3.5-liter V6, and a hybrid version of that power plant. There are even more options when you consider the Raptor and Lightning variants. Plus, the company offers versions with prices that exceed $80,000, so if there's a configuration that someone wants, then it probably exists. When it comes to towing and hauling, these are the trucks you want. Modern heavy-duty pickups can typically trailer around 30,000 pounds and haul 15,000 pounds of payload thanks to their powerful V8 and diesel engine options, as well as available dual rear wheels. Believe it or not, the Titan XD is alive and kicking for the 2024 model year. As with the half-ton Titan, the XD is outdated, and compared to other HD trucks on this list, it falls well short of the benchmark 30,000 plus towing capacity, primarily because it's only offered with single rear wheels and a gasoline engine. Available with either a powerful Hemi 6.4 liter V8 or the legendary Cummins turbo diesel inline 6, making up to 1,075 pound-feet of torque in the 3500 model, the Ram Heavy Duty is capable of doing some pretty hard work. However, it's one of the oldest trucks in its class, with buckboard handling and an infotainment package that once wowed us but now merely feels average. The 2024 GMC Sierra HD arrives with many of the same cosmetic and functional upgrades as the Sierra 1500 before it. That means an excellent 13.2-inch infotainment system on all but the base trims, as well as standard automatic emergency braking and available adaptive cruise control that you can even use while towing. Its available diesel V8 makes 470 horsepower and 975 pound-feet, enabling a tow rating of up to 36,000 pounds on the 3500 HD. Like the Sierra HD, the 2024 Chevrolet Silverado HD arrives with a new 10-speed Allison automatic gearbox on the gasoline 6.6-liter V8, more power for the optional 6.6-liter Duramax diesel, and an off-road ZR2 model that boasts Multimatic DSSV dampers. There's also a redesigned interior with a 13.2-inch infotainment display on all but the WT and custom trims, and more standard and optional equipment across the board. Like the Sierra HD, the Silverado offers up to 470 horsepower and 36,000 pounds of towing ability. The 2024 Ford F-Series Super Duty puts out a staggering 500 horsepower and 1,200 pound-feet of torque from its high-output 6.7-liter diesel V8, enabling the F450 model to tow 40,000 pounds. 
Even without that truck's cheat code widened front axle and 19.5 inch medium duty wheels, the F-350 can still tug 38,000 pounds. Performance trucks have historically occupied a small space in the larger truck segment, but these days there are more off-road capable and high horsepower pickups on the market than ever. Even the smallest trucks have some performance upgrades worth considering. The Ford Maverick Tremor has a few neat tricks up its sleeve. Off-road shocks, underbody protection, and 9.4 inches of ground clearance make it genuinely capable for a small unibody vehicle. But in the realm of off-road trucks, the Maverick's construction and single-speed transfer case hold it back against the more traditional ladder frame options. The Ram 2500 Power Wagon is one big, bad machine. Its 6.4 liter V8 gives it 410 horsepower, while solid front and rear axles with an articulink feature give it better flex when out on the trail. There's one big downside of the 2500 Power Wagon, and that's price. You won't be able to get into a 2024 model for less than $72,000. GMC is getting more aggressive with its off-road offerings with the recent arrival of the AT4X lineup, as opposed to the softer AT4. In this case, the AT4X adds a reworked suspension with Multimatic DSSV shocks, tougher tires, a taller 11.1 inch ride height, and a meaner exterior design. If fuel economy is your focus though, the AT4X falls to the bottom of the pack. It's also by far the most expensive of the competitive set. Until we get our hands on the 2024 Tacoma TRD Pro, we're putting the dated 2023 model toward the back of the pack. Its V6 engine is lethargic, its 9.4 inches of ground clearance are below average, and the cabin is sparse. That said, it still has excellent off-road chops and a bevy of equipment designed specifically for the trail. The new Toyota Tundra TRD Pro is one of the toughest trucks out there. With a twin-turbocharged hybridized 3.5 liter V6, it packs a powerful 437 horses, and standard off-road equipment includes an electronic locking rear differential, 2.5 inch Fox dampers, and a decent 10.9 inches of ground clearance. That said, the TRD Pro model still isn't as capable as some of the other off-road trucks higher up on this list. As far as heavy-duty pickup trucks go, the new Silverado HD ZR2 Bison is the off-road king. Its 6.6-liter V8 turbo diesel engine gives it a whopping 975 pound-feet of torque, and it comes standard with Multimatic DSSV spool valve shocks and 11.6 inches of ground clearance. That affords it some of the best off-road angles out there. Its size alone makes it tough to recommend over any of the half-ton options, but the HD ZR2 Bison makes it a compelling case. All of the excellent off-road equipment offered on the Silverado HD ZR2 and Bison originally came from the smaller Silverado 1500, and the half-ton truck is even better. With standard Multimatic DSSV shocks, 18-inch wheels, and 11.2 inches of ground clearance, the Silverado ZR2 and the more aggressive Bison models are both able to conquer most trails you throw at them. Picking between the bigger Silverado and Colorado in ZR2 form is like asking us to choose a favorite child. They're both great. But the Colorado is brand spanking new, and both its platform and turbocharged 2.7 liter engine are excellent. Tack on those brilliant Multimatic DSSV dampers and a best-in-class 12.1 inches of ground clearance, and it's easily our favorite of the small off-roaders. Get yourself a Ram 1500 TRX before it's gone. The 702 horsepower super truck is being discontinued after the 2024 model year, but it's still one of our favorite performance pickups of all time. Its supercharged 6.2 liter V8 launches the TRX to 60 in just 4.0 seconds. Add to that off-road tires and Bilstein active dampers, and the Ram 1500 TRX is an absolute thrill on and off the pavement. Check out our comparison of the Ram 1500 TRX and Ford F-150 Raptor R here. At the top of the performance heap is the 2024 Ford F-150 Raptor and V8 powered Raptor R. The latter comes with 700 horsepower thanks to a supercharged 5.2 liter engine borrowed from the Shelby GT500, which gives it a 0 to 60 time of just under 4 seconds. Knobby 37 inch tires and a pliable suspension with Fox live valve shocks designed specifically for this truck make it the ultimate off-roader. Bound to be one of the most populated segments in the next few years, electric trucks are just starting to get a foothold in the market. New players like Tesla and Rivian are taking on the giants at Ford and GM as the electric truck wars rage on. Until we get our hands on the new Tesla Cybertruck and know exactly what this thing is capable of, we'll keep the awkward looking pickup at number 5. But the initial specs are promising. It can tow 11,000 pounds, it has a 2,500 pound payload capacity, and it's able to hit 60 miles per hour in 2.5 seconds. If all of that rings true, 
the Cybertruck would be one of the most capable trucks in this class. GMC brought back the Hummer name in the form of a radical 9,000 pound electric pickup, followed shortly thereafter by an SUV counterpart. The launch edition landed with 1,000 horsepower and a price tag of $112,595, but slightly more affordable and less powerful versions have since trickled out. Regardless of power or price, the Hummer EV has an unforgiving ride, an unwelcoming cabin, and below average driving dynamics, but it's good in a straight line at least. We've only driven the base Silverado EV WT, but even in that form the electric Silverado is compelling. With up to 450 miles of range and 10,000 pounds of towing, the work-ready Silverado has some of the best specs in the segment. And although its interior is Spartan in WT form, we know that more premium versions of the Silverado EV will have huge touchscreens and loads of leather. Everything we love about the gas F-150 carries over to the Lightning. The only difference, of course, is the electric powertrain, which is up to 580 horsepower in top spec and 320 miles of range at its most efficient. It's a wonderful truck to drive, the cabin is well equipped and premium, and it can still tow up to 10,000 pounds. The Rivian R1T is the top dog of the class thanks to its impressive power, towing abilities, and range. The electric truck has up to 835 horsepower in quad motor form and can tug up to 11,000 pounds, matching the Cybertruck. It's also exceptionally nice to drive, premium inside, and priced competitively.